Thanks for checking out this haul video. So I have a few things to go over real quick. Some people may be seeing this and saying, I know what this is, and maybe you do know what it is, and it's something I've been wanting for a while. So two of these items, there's three items here. There's two items that are coming from the same place that I decided to purchase for myself as a gift for myself for my birthday, which is in May. So this is my happy birthday early to me uh, gift. It's something I've been eyeing, well, two things I've been eyeing for quite a while. Um, and then the other thing is something that a friend just gave me, uh, which very surprising that someone would just give me this. So I needed to share this with people. So I figured it made sense as part of the haul video. So let's start with the things I ordered. So I ordered from a uh, vinegar syndrome, as you know, I've had other haul videos from stuff from vinegar syndrome, and I've also been on a big giallo kick. So this is one I've been eyeing, which is the forgotten gialli volume one. Now this isn't the one with the really nice big box set to it um, because this, I, I believe this is kind of like a reissue type deal that they did. Um, so yeah, they, um, yeah, it's not as great as getting like that really nice box set like I had from their, uh, from Severin's like Lindsay Baker collection of Giallo films, but it's still, I'm getting the films and there's three films in here. I'm not going to read the synopses of them because I like to go into almost all my movies, especially Giallo films, totally blind, not knowing anything, so I can't read this. But it has Trauma, which I believe Shudder was supposed to have put up uh, on their streaming service back in, what, November, and they never did. It was either November or December they were supposed to put it up, and they didn't do it. Um, there were a few of those films, actually. Uh, Police Are Blundering in the Dark is another one, and The Killer is one of 13, so... Excited to get into these. I love the artwork on it. Looks really good. Excited to get into this. And I will. And I will have reviews on my channel of every single one of these. And I will also have reviews of every single one of the next ones, which is Forgotten Gialli Volume 2. Uh, they have three volumes at this point through Vinegar Syndrome. And I thought about getting all three, but I didn't want to spend that much money at once. So I might get the third volume at some point. Plus, when I looked at the IMDb ratings of all the movies, it seems like collections, volume one and volume two have pretty good ratings, and then once you get to volume three, it's like it's falling off a decent amount. So this one is one of the first uh, runs, I guess, because it's actually in the box, which that, that artwork looks ridiculous. And then there's kind of like an alternate artwork there. And that's got all of them on the side, and it is Girl in Room 2A, My Dear Killer, and the French Sex Murders. And I'm going to go ahead and open it up because then they each have their own. Sometimes it's hard to get them all out at once because of the air suction. So anyway, here we go. We have Girl in Room 2A. That looks pretty cool. That looks really cool. We have... The French Sex Murders, also looking interesting. Totally different artwork there for that one. I like that. And the last one, My Dear Killer, which looks the best by far. And you've already seen this because it's on the one side. Very, very cool. So I'm very interested in getting into these. I really do wish that they still had available for Volume 1 one of these dealios because... They're really nice, and you know, as you can see, they're they're like pretty thick cardboard, so they're pretty nice. So I really wish I had the first one, but I'm just glad to have the movies. And like I said, just like with the first volume, with the second volume, I will have reviews for all those movies. Now, the last thing of this haul video was given to me by a longtime friend. He's, I mean, he's my best friend, Rich Smith. Uh, if you know Rich. You, you might know Rich if you attend our watch parties. Rich shows up to the watch parties a lot. He's a great guy. And for some reason, well, because he's a good friend, he decided to just give me his Dawn of the Dead Blu-ray, which I can't find available used for less than $55 online, at least not when I looked last um, so yeah, I, this is not easy to find, not, the DVD's not easy to find, the Blu-ray's not easy to find, and they had had the, the new version with the, the, that, like, box set with four different versions of the film that came out not long ago, and I thought about getting that, but it wasn't super cheap, because it was four different versions of the film, 
and it was a big box set. And I was like, I don't need four versions of a movie. I just want one version of the movie. So I decided to pass on that. Uh, and then I've just been trying to see if I can get Dawn of the Dead anywhere. Because I will say this, and people are going to flip out. I've never seen the original Dawn of the Dead. So this means I will be watching it, and soon. And I also have in my stack of movies up here, Day of the Dead, which I bought not long ago. Which I have seen before. Um, and so I'm, I'm planning to just watch this, and then watch Day of the Dead also. And do reviews on both of those, and put them on my channel. So... Big thank you to Rich. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is awesome. Some people may be saying, why would he just give you this? I mean, other than just being a great friend, he actually has a like a special collector's edition box set of DVD, Dawn of the Dead, which in, in that one also has multiple versions of the film. And he also got that signed by George A. Romero. I was there with him when he got it signed when both of us met him. Um, so he was like, I don't really need the Blu-ray because I have the DVDs and obviously that's what's more important because not only is it a better edition because it has extra and it's collector's edition, but it's also signed by George A. Romero. So, so yeah, hell of a guy giving me this. So yeah, that's my haul video. I will be doing more haul videos. I actually do have some more movies coming <laughs> because I also made an additional purchase for myself for my birthday. Um... It's almost all Giallo in that next one, I will tell you. But I don't know when it's showing up. It was a purchase through Grindhouse Video, um, who's affiliated with Arrow. Because uh, they were having an Easter sale where a lot of them were like 50% off. So I got some really good deals. It was one of those things I wasn't planning on purchasing, but I saw an ad for it online. And I was like, oh, 50% off. If they have some good Giallos, I can... Yeah. And there's one in there that is not Giallo. And I'm very interested... To I mean, I'm very excited to let people know what that one is, but that'll be coming whenever I end up getting it. I don't know when that's going to be because I think they have a lot of orders to fill because of that sale. But anyway, thanks for checking out this haul video. If you like this video or any video I've ever done, do me a solid. Hit that subscribe button because not only does it help me with growing the channel, but it helps motivate me. Every time I get new subscribers, I legitimately look at who it is and I say thank you to this person. That's really awesome. And it just lets me know that People are actually caring about what I'm doing here, and that feels good. It's good to know that you're connecting with someone, so it keeps me fueled to keep doing videos like this. So anyway, uh, I'll, so do the subscription, the uh, the subscribe button. I'm sorry, I'm getting a little tired today. Uh, and also hit the notification bell button, and that way you'll know when I put up new videos, whether it's this or one of my movie reviews or any of that jazz. But regardless, thanks for checking this out, and until next time, keep it brutal.